Facebook. What's up, everybody? This your girl, Keisha R. Jackson, aka okay? Famous. And, like, I just came from getting my fucking nails and toes thin. You know, my mani Patty And fucking... So I was in a good mood, right? So I stopped and got this nasty ass snowball because, see, this ain't from the place I wanted to come from. I wanted mine to come from the big Cahoon on Dido Road. Well, I had to settle for the other one down the street. Okay, and this one ain't like the big Kahunas. The ice is not all that, and the flavor don't taste like the big Kahuna. So while I was getting in the motherfucking car, I'm getting this piece of shit, I fucked up my nail. See that shit? See that? Hold on, let me back it up. You can't really tell, but you know I can because I had to put pull the paint back. So anyway, so Dewey went with me and season went with me. Well, on the way home, Dewey was like, "Stop at the store. Let me get something from the to gas station." So I pull over and fucking I pulled up into the handicapped parking space. You know what I'm saying? Just because they parking our shit. You know what I'm saying? Um, but I knew I wasn't going to be there. But I wasn't even getting out the motherfucking car. He was going in there, running in, and coming out. Some little white girl up in a goddamn green Durango was like, she got to be motherfucking a goddamn handicapped ass fucking activist or something. Because this hoe, she look over at me and she, she, she open her door and look out the fucking door and I told Dewey I said what the fuck is wrong with her she must got a goddamn problem or something and then so she starts shaking her head and she just sitting there and she got all this bullshit in the fucking back of the goddamn goddamn truck okay and then the bitch look over some more and so I'm looking at her and I'm like bitch you got a motherfucking problem what the fuck is wrong with you ho you know what I'm saying so she waiting on her little black friend or whatever to come out the goddamn girl got on a Winn-Dixie smock so these hoes uh they sitting there in the goddamn car and she say something to her little black friend like maybe her black friend could whoop my ass now one of these hoes gonna whoop my ass okay bitch I'm parking the handicapped motherfucking parking spot all goddamn day long as fuck I want to so I do it up in the motherfucking store this bitch this hoe this stank ass bitch gonna bag up her motherfucking ragged ass motherfucking Durango and I'm thinking to myself bitch you lucky that ragged piece of shit is running okay so she gonna bag that shit up and I guess she got my motherfucking tag number and I guess she called herself calling it in to the police so you know what if the motherfucking police show up at my door talking about some handicap ass bullshit all I'm gonna say is look here did you see me in handicapped parking space? <laughs> and if he say no, I'm just going to be like, well, how can you believe that I was in a handicapped parking space? You can't go by hearsay. You the motherfucking police, goddammit. You supposed to know what the fuck you goddamn talking about. You can't just be coming over here talking that shit. But she got to be a motherfucking handicapped activist or something like she must got a whole shitload of handicapped kids or something. Like, you know what I'm saying? And she must really care. But I'm like, God damn. Bitch, I'm only there for a goddamn not even a minute. Goddamn, bitch. Hold your motherfucking horses. Chill the fuck out. I mean, for real? Don't get me wrong. I ain't got nothing against handicapped people. Lord knows I don't. But, bitch, if I feel the need to to pull my ass up in one of them goddamn handicapped parking spaces, I am because I done seen motherfuckers pull up in our shit. You know what I'm saying? So, of course, thank you. Anyway, I just want to bust you out, Calvin. So, <clears throat> bitch, you supposed to be coming to get the kids tomorrow, right? So, ho, ho, I done called child support on you, bitch. Because I want to know, is it like a new law that you only pay child support one time and then uh, stop paying child support? So, I done called. They told me, nigga, that you ain't got no motherfucking job. Now, let's talk about how sorry you is. You remember when I asked you at the beginning of the fucking school year what days you was off? And you going to tell me on Saturday and Sunday, like, you got a fucking job. Bitch, 
Now you can't pay no motherfucking child support, but you also can't even pick your motherfucking kids up from school and daycare because you doing nothing all motherfucking day long. See, see, you a sorry ass motherfucking excuse for a goddamn daddy. You already ain't helping me pay no goddamn child support. You ain't paying no child support. <laughs> You ain't doing shit. You don't buy no school clothes. You don't buy no school shoes. You don't buy a goddamn thing over here. Now, any other baby daddy, if it was anybody else, they they would have no fucking problem picking their kids up from school and daycare. And Caesar shouldn't even be sitting his big ass in daycare. Caesar need to be in school, but they telling me that I make too much money for him to go to head start and his birthday late so he can't go to kindergarten. So, you telling me you rather me pay motherfucking $120 a week for your kids to go to motherfucking daycare for season to go all day and for Kai to go after school. See you, you a sour ass motherfucking nigga. And that's why um, I sure did. I, I want to know if it's a penalty for your motherfucking ass not paying child support. I don't give a fuck if you got a job or not, nigga. Because guess what? You selling motherfucking dope out there on motherfucking Dove Street and goddamn Sears City. Bitch, play with me if you goddamn want to. But I have y'all all motherfuckers. All you motherfuckers lock the fuck up. Because I'll send the police out there my goddamn self and let them know what the fuck you goddamn doing, nigga. Think it's a motherfucker game bitch I send him over there to Maria house cause I'm pretty sure you're selling dope about her shit too okay keep on playing me if you fucking want to nigga and I already fucking know that you and Maria are gonna be watching this goddamn video when I post it and I know that bitch better not motherfucking text my goddamn phone talking about Ehh! cause bitch the video ain't about you it's about motherfucking him so if you want motherfucking beef bitch I done had a bad motherfucking day I can fight pregnant and all bitch cause that's the best way to goddamn do it Fuck with me if you goddamn want to, bitch. Because I ain't, I ain't playing today, goddammit. I want to send a goddamn red alert on this motherfucker. I want these motherfuckers to give me my goddamn child support or put your ass in jail. Man, I wish your ass could sit behind motherfucking bars forever for not paying goddamn child support. I hate you, nigga. I wish you fucking die of cockeyedness because goddamn your ass so motherfucking cockeyed is ridiculous. <laughs> <laughs> that I'm fucking cock out in this. Yo, fucking. I just hate you. You need to pay some fucking child support. If you don't, nigga, trust and believe. I swear to God, my name ain't Keisha R. Jackson, aka Famous. Police gonna be some motherfucking hot in Sears City. <laughs> okay. <laughs> On Dove Street. And then, and then that street that's by Dove Street, you know where that, where that, uh, sign that, that that's got that. That sign that go left or right, it's got them arrows. I know you be on that motherfucking street because I seen you come out the crack house one day. Um, and they'll be all hot in motherfucking Sears City, okay? I have a, I have a goddamn squad car all on Williamsburg motherfucking drive over there by my real motherfucking house. <laughs> Think it's a goddamn guy, boo. I'm not fucking playing, goddamn it, because... Reason why I'm so motherfucking mad is because bitch, you you ain't paying no fucking child support. But then when I try to get some fucking help from your dirty black fat ugly musty motherfucking ass, your fucking bitch ass go tell me that you off on Saturdays and Sundays. But motherfucking, you ain't even working. So you telling me you can't uh, you 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 can't even keep your motherfucking kids. You can't keep Caesar all fucking day, and you can't keep Kai until he get from after school up until my mama come get him. You sorry ass nigga, but you wanna sit back and go to motherfucking court and make it seem like you such a, a just, uh, you you just a good ass motherfucking daddy and you care so goddamn much, bitch. Please, bitch, I'm here to expose your motherfucking ass. I'm here to expose a weak ass, nothing ass, piece of shit ass, broke ass motherfucking baby daddy. You have motherfucking been exposed, bitch. Now. This your girl, Keisha R. Jackson, a.k.a. Famous, and I'm out this motherfucker. Deuces, y'all.